Welcome to Shell World, where everything's a shell, and they also have tentacles. Fight, fight, fight! Space. Anadar, your turn. Um, if well, I remember to call this episode Shell Game, I'll be very impressed with myself. We're gonna shell shock these fools. Yeah, we friggin' are, too. Return um, of the Ooze. Gonna really deal out a shellacking. You guys sicken me. <laughs> Um, I'm the only one not making bad jokes. What yeah. world is this? I mean, okay. Well, well, I mean, You're to be fair. From ourself. To be fair, I mean, most most of Icarus is a bad joke, so. I'm going to equip. I think, hopefully. Ooh. If he's keeping all his bad jokes to himself, would that make him shellfish? <laughs> shellfish? <laughs> sure, why? Oh. Definitely. Why not? This is I, why my fellowship score is so low, by the way. Well, it's because I just make really bad jokes all the time. Dad joke territory. Okay, well, I'm going to move closer. Can I put this here in it? Is the... Oh, that's... Probably should have made that joke when we were talking about the lobsters. It takes a while for Merrick's joke processes to kick in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I have them on, on reserve, like, backup priority. Mm -hmm. I'm too busy looking uh, at the plant. Move forward a beautiful 10 squares. Okay. And then I'm going to. At this thing, I'm going to full auto burst it. How far away am I? Uh, Set so 10 and then move 2 on my screen. It, it's because each one of these tiles is set up as 5 meters. Yeah. So, like, right now, they're 75 uh, meters away from us. Or at least yeah. away from me. Oh, that's... Map. Hold on, I'm sorry. Let me... Let me... I think the <sighs> default is each tile's always five units. Uh, in that case, five. I would not have moved, probably, because yeah. I would be in short. Okay, that Ooh. should be fixed now. Oh, sorry. Back on the ship. Boop. Boop. Yeah, there we go. Oh, now we even have our... Yeah. Now we're not covering our... Lovely. Oh, uh, that's what happened with our conversion, conversion. fields. Yeah. We oh, we didn't even show the... tiny. Yeah, because our icons that's were funny. too big. That's really funny. Okay, sorry about that. Yep, there you go. Okay. Yeah. All right, then. And then I will. Uh, I'm gonna full auto burst this thing at short range. It's average size, I suppose. Uh, no. Oh. It is. Uh. It is two above average size. Oh, is... it's actually massive. Yeah, they're, well, they're enormous. They're... But it's actually really big. Yeah. Yeah. And then, then I'm going Damn to it. shoot it with my shard carbine number Can't one. Can't believe I didn't bring any anti-plant grenades. And it's okay, Skizzle has a flamer. And I'm and I'm going to shoot with another gun after this, but this gun first. Okay. Actually. Maybe setting the entire place on fire is a bad idea. Especially while we're in it. Yeah, I wouldn't do that. Go ahead. And hits. As it's slowly ticking down. How many hits did you get? Oh my god. I, I got 10. Wow. Um, okay. And the toughness test it has to make is for... Um, let me find... Let me find the poison. Let me find the poison that I've poisoned it with. Oh, toxic. Here we go. Yeah. No. I mean, one point of damage, make a toughness test. No, I've got a different poison. Oh, oh okay. You rolled a nine degrees of success and hit it. One, two. It three. is uh, yeah, uh, liquid it ten it times. Is, it is liquid agony. Okay. Which means if it fails the toughness test, then it's stunned for a number of rounds equal to its own perception bonus. As it is completely overloaded. Fail, so it's stunned. Beautiful. And the other one. Uh, how far is that piece from there? Can I see the other one next to it? Uh, you can see the one over here next yeah. to it, but you cannot see the one behind it. It's, yeah, I'm gonna it's... I'm gonna shoot that one with the other gun. Bang. That is also loaded with the same stunning garbage. Okay. 
see a stun date. I'm just going to use... Uh, Okay, you're good. You hit it again. God, you hit it so many times. So, uh, you hit it eight times that time. Uh, and... Uh, toughness test. This first characteristic. Fails. Okay, so that one's also stunned. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm going to say... Night, 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 baby, or something stupid in Eldar. Okay. And also Holt's get a pain token. Holt's turn. Um, would it be possible if I were to move, like, up here to get vision of the guy in the back? Uh, back here? Yeah. Let me see. Keeping in mind that I'd be using a psychic power on it. Yeah, yeah you have vision there. I can, okay. Using the measuring tool, I can see, can see straight past it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do a four splinters. Uh, Ethan, what guns were you using? Your splinter rifle? I used the splinter rifle and a shard carbine. Okay, so yeah, your your splinter rifle rounds just bury themselves into the shell, tearing them up on different parts of it, but not really doing much to the tentacle things coming out of the bottom. Ugh. Ugh. Hmm. Oh, hmm. Strong tentacles. This is the worst kind. Yep. Um, okay, I think I have that done correctly. Uh, Perils of the Warp. Alright, give me a moment to go look at the book. Oh, do you have to come and stand next to me to do Take this? Take a look, it's in the book. <laughs> Every time. That's how you know uh, that he really loves you. What so you I options? rolled... A, uh, I rolled a straight 60 and then I rolled it zero. So I can... I can start gibbering, or I can throw my mind out of my body and into someone else's body. Oh, that sounds fun. <laughs> Freaky Friday. Yeah, become, I get become the other tentative tentative thing. Sanity, though. Yeah, can you get into one of the... Uh... No, it's it's random. Duh. So I could end up in like inside Anadar's body and then ugh, yeah, you kill myself. Yeah, you definitely don't want that. It's awful in here. Especially if you are not used to the, all of the weird things that he's no, done to himself. All of the things. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to take the one where I don't get thrown out of my body. Bummer. Pretty good, pretty good choice. Okay, so I need to make a willpower test or I get stunned and gain two insanity points. Everyone's stunned today. Uh, so that's a test versus character. We already made a shell shock joke, right? Power. Okay, yeah. so yeah, nothing happens. Okay. And then I hit. What is that? Seven times? Looks right. Uh. What, what kind of damage is that? It's psychic. It, well, it's uh, force. It... Sorry. Impact, right? Impact, sorry, yeah. Impact. So, 17. It's painful damage. Does that have penetration, or is that... No, uh, it doesn't. It doesn't. So, 17, 15, 20, 22, and 18. Jeez. And then there's one more. There's a 26 at the end. Yeah. Damage. There we go. Okay. Uh, your crew are going to start attacking. Uh, is there? I wish I heard what Nuggan said, but I didn't. I you said your crew to attack. Yeah, your crew are attacking. Uh, they're going to start attacking this cloak. Oh, you know what, Nuggan? Off of every single one of those, it each one of those attacks did six less damage than it should have. It did six less than it should have? Why is it? Yeah. Uh, because it only counted my PR as being six instead of nine. Oh, okay. So... So that would have been... Uh, 
infinity more damage. Like 42 more points of damage overall. 42. Okay. Uh, and ignore armor. I've killed that one. Okay. Okay, so your crew takes a shot. It aims with its uh, big, very long crew hunting rifle. Uh, mm hmm and a fires into the shell of this closest one hits it uh the next crew so attacking that same one they, they're trying to take out this close first uh but he misses just ricochets straight off the shell uh the your uh hunting party leader Karik, is Attacking that one is Oh, uh, I have to fix his token because it does like apostrophes in the name. Wow. Oh, lucky. There, okay. Uh, let's try that again. Kind of self-respecting space game program doesn't allow apostrophes in names. Like, really? I mean, like, yeah. you, know, you would think that that would be something they would handle. Ah, oh, he misses, though. Uh, it's Kenor's turn. What's John Silkernicus doing? Well, why are some of the crew unarmed? Um, They're not unarmed. They just didn't grab their I, I'm rifle. I'm guessing their weapon's not equipped. Yeah. Well, okay, so I'm gonna... This closest shell beast, I guess I'm gonna... Um... I'm gonna try shooting it with my wrath, uh, wrath plasma pistol just to see what happens. Okay. Nice. Um, it's standard action. It was was it enormous or hulking? Enormous. Is it enormous. Two more, two more than average. Yeah. I predict it. <laughs> and <clears throat> tissue damage. Let's see. Distance is what is distance? Thirteen. Why is it not telling me what the distance is? Uh, it's probably short. From you to that Yeah, creature, it's 13. It 13. It's 13, yes. Yeah. Um, okay. That is indeed short, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, that's short. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, I hit it in the legs. Yep, yep. You you shoot and your your plasma stream blasts a little chunk of one of the tentacles off. It's still coming at you. Uh, Isn't it stunned? It, it it is, but it's not it's not dead yet. It's not... It wants to come at you. Yeah, it uh, wants to. Okay. Well, I'm gonna. I guess I'll just use my pla uh, my grenade on on both of the them and see what happens then. Okay. Because uh, I have frag and stun in currently. Can you take two attacks like that? Yes, I can, because I okay. have recall gloves, which oh. means the grenade launchers are considered one-handed. Great. And I have all of the pew, pew, gunslinger stuff. Uh, so it's pretty amazing, all things considered. Um... Okay, that didn't work. Uh, error executing copy token. Ah, oh, okay. So, just roll your regular attack? Yeah. Uh, so that, sh 64, that should hit dead on. Yes. Plus 30. Uh, it has a blast of 4, so it should hit both should of them. should hit both of them. Yep, and the damage is... It it's it's just a normal frag, so it's 2d10. So roll. Yep, roll 2d10. Almost average. I've never seen such completely average grenades. I, I roll. I do average. Gun. Yeah, that, that's all he does is average yeah. grenade damage. So uh, the blast hits both of them, uh, but it doesn't seem to hurt them at, at all. It seems to sort of just. All the little uh, frag pieces 
blast into the shells and mm -hmm. really penetrate them at all. Yeah, okay. Yep. Okay, so uh, you recruit, continue attacking the closest one, trying to take it out. Uh, the this crew hits with his uh, rifle, and your your next one. They're doing their best, aiming for whatever spots well, they can the find shell. on this thing. But yeah, mm -hmm. they, it's the the shell is enormous compared to the rest of the tentacles. So they're having a hard time getting getting good shots in. Mm -hmm. uh, <clears throat> one of them hits the the second crew misses completely uh and it's merrick's turn oh boy well you know what goes through shells really good melt -a guns so i'm gonna no i'm not attacking with it i just need it equipped thank you because you won't let me quit multiple things at once uh let's see now i'm attacking with it That's right, you don't click on the other thing first, you click on it second. Mm -hmm. I'm actually targeting, because this has, I'm pretty sure, a, uh, this is a blast one. So I'm trying to target the square in between them so I can hit both of them. Okay. But I'm going to target one of them, I guess, to, can you do that? Can you attack ground, actually? Uh, Depends on what so is it a is it a it's a weapon that has a blast? Yeah, it's a blast one. I'm pretty sure. Can someone double check that, Ethan? Do you have the spreadsheet? Yep. I need the, the link to that. By the way, I lost it. The the multi multi mouse pad is a blast one. Yeah. Yeah, I I don't see why you couldn't attack the ground then. So I guess I'll just roll against one of the things just to make the roll. Yeah, that works. Uh, standard attack. Yeah, well, it doesn't matter what you're attacking, right? It's it's against your ballistic skill. Yeah, they that's don't true. They will affect it. Yeah, that's true. Uh, well, isn't one square just like the four? It's the it's a, directions. It's a three by three. Is it? Oh, is it? I don't know. I, I, I think it, was... it is just the cardinal directions. I don't oh, think it okay. does diagonals. If that's the case, then I need to. Uh... Actually, what does that mean? One. Blast two, well, I assume, I mean, does include the diagonals, right? It would be weird. Yeah, yeah, no, no, bl 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 no, no, blast two would include the diagonals. Yeah, that's okay. right. Well, I'll just target what the the one that's most damaged then. Okay, no problem. Let's let's have a look. Let's see if there's a thing in the in the book. Normal, short range, or is it point blank? I think it's short. Oh, uh, that's short. That's not point blank. Actually, oh, it might not, because I know when we're moving, it only counts as one if we're stepping diagonally. Yeah, if diagonally only counts as one, then... I'm pretty then sure my also we've do been playing with my grenades doing diagonal, and they're... I yeah, but, yeah but, no, but, no, but they're blast two, so they would do diagonal. Well, they're blast four. But yes. Yeah, but they would do diagonal. Like, the diagonals yeah. definitely do occur, I just don't know if they occur for blast one, because if diagonals are one square, then... It should then, right? If diagonal yeah. is one square, it's one square. So, mm -hmm. all right, let's let's pull up. And uh, meanwhile, Grunty just rolled. Yeah. Uh, so if I'm gonna go for the square in between them, I'm gonna say there's no size bonus because I'm not aiming at a big thing. I'm aiming at a point of ground. I agree. Yes. Uh, use logis. Yes. Okay. Bang. Why does it always ask for tech use skills? Well, it just sucks. It shouldn't ask should never for use that. it. Are you good with the? Yep. Yep. Go ahead. They're not exactly going to dodge. Uh, you Probably not. Okay, so I should have hit both of them then. Okay, penetration is twenty-six. You did thirty-five damage. Near roll. Turns out I'm using an anti-tank gun, so yeah, that should that should work. Okay, so the other one gets hit for 35, 26 penetration. Yeah. That's insane. I mean, you, it's a melted gun. It's the only way you can actually attack a vehicle is with a melted yeah, gun. Yeah, you you roll. They all you have got, like a thousand armor. You have to roll damage for each of them separately. Yeah. So what is that? It's uh, 
40. No, I just I just use the same one for now. That's fine. Works for me. I got a six, seven, eight, nine on my rolls apparently. Pretty good. Yeah, I, I'm still looking for the blast things in the book, but that's oh, oh. It, it just it just I says it, it, was... it just says that it's that range in meters. So if we're using diagonals, it is one meter. Then okay, then that should, it be should correct. Yeah. Icarus, it's your turn. I'm looking around to see if our gunfire is attracting attention of any other creatures. Ah, five degrees what? of success. What? Yes, uh, yes, actually, you see as you're looking around, uh, up in the trees nearby this cleared out area where you are, there's actually three more of these creatures. There's one here, one here, and one here. That's bad. Yeah. There's, there's there's three more, and they're they're not on the ground. They are actually up in the trees, holding on with their. I call this out to everybody. It's like, hey guys, there's weird things in the trees. <sighs> I was hoping me and Mac could be run be able to run over and pull one of these stunned ones out of the shell and check it out. But... Uh, there's probably going to be. I mean, with with the number that we're dealing with, at least one of them will probably survive somewhat intact. <laughs> I'm not too worried about it. I'm wondering if I should use my stone bolt or if I should switch to my infernal pistol because the shells seem to be pretty tough. Did uh, Icarus actually point us out to the dudes in the trees? Yes. Yeah. Okay, good. Um, I, I guess I'll target this one in the tree over here. Yeah, see if you can get it to fall out. Uh, I don't think I'll do much damage to it. It's heavily armored. Bonus points if it falls out of the tree. Uh, I, f I feel like I should switch to my infernal pistol. Yeah, you probably should. So let's switch. Okay. So I don't get any aim because I switched. It's standard attack. Uh, the distance, I think it was 11, so it's actually standard, right? Yep. Um, it's enormous. It's not fully concealed. Uh, large fury. You can actually select it at all. It doesn't seem to be any. Oh, I'm on the wrong tool. There you go. I have to reselect everything because I wasn't selected. Oh, I love that. Uh, okay. And that's everything. Okay. Okay. Uh, let me roll initiative for that. Since you brought him into combat. It's going to be really funny if those dudes weren't even going to attack us. Uh, because they're shitty snails. I think they were seeing they were in the trees waiting to jump they, down and eat us. Were they? Unless they were just in the trees. Unless they were just like, in the trees. It I is. Buy them. Marcella's turn. She is just going to hang she? out next to me. She, she doesn't. She, she's not on the. Oh, oh there she is. Yeah, she is. She's, she's camouflaged. She's just going to come over to me. I think she can do that. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Then this shell beast is stunned. Uh, next is uh, this one here that's in the tree that Icarus just shot at. Uh, as you're all looking up where Icarus just fired into the canopy above you, you see this creature here that was just shot sort of wake up and start flailing its tentacles around, and it gets an really good grip on one of the branches and it moves with a speed that's incredibly surprising to all of you as it swings through the trees with its tentacles and comes slamming into the ground right next to Icarus. Oh, I, was hoping, I was hoping it was going to wreck and bowl him and just fly into him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it reaches out to, to grab at him with its tentacles. Why does this have two of these? Okay. Oh, that's why. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, it reaches for Icarus with his with its tentacles. Uh, it is making a charge attack. It's sloppy huggy arms. And... This thing is gonna hit really hard because it's it gonna, has twelve strength. It's gonna tear Icarus in. Two. Hopefully, I can dodge. Uh, 
Are you trying to dodge? Yes. I have not got a thing yet, so... Uh, it, it came up for me, probably because I have ownership of your token. So dodge well, or parry. Dodge, you... dodge me, then. Dodge. The conversion oh, field nice. managed to nullify... Dodge. Tried to yoink him, but... No dice. Can't yoink through ah, the conversion field half the you time. You know, would have been only 17 damage, which isn't too bad. Yeah, uh, that's Next fine. one here is... Uh, stunned as well. And then these two over here I'm going to add to initiative now. That's what you get for trying to fight him, Icarus. They were just minding their own business. And uh, then we'll get to go this turn, because they're just sitting there. And it's Anadar's turn. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, so... Deal with these weird crabs. Crab tentacle turtles. I mean... I can finish them off or we'll shoot the one that's near Icarus. Help him out, because he sucks. Yeah, I'll walk over. You know, I'm gonna walk up the point blank range. Fuck it. Just put the muzzle on its weird tentacle beak. Yeah, I'm pulling out the disintegrator can and I'm done with it. I'm done with this one being near Icarus. Wow, you're helping out your good friend. No, it's just he doesn't want anyone else torturing him. That's yeah, <laughs> that's pretty much. That's pretty much it. Yeah. Uh, yep, 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 yep. Okay. Ooh, you you really wreck it. Is this the uh? Same uh, toughness nice. test? Uh, no, this is just the disintegrated okay. can. I'm just shooting it with bolts of energy stolen from okay, us. Okay, yeah, you're you're blasting into the shell from point blank range and just carving chunk after chunk out of it uh, to to get down to the soft belly inside of this creature. Delicious. Uh, you can escar go away from Icarus. Huh? Uh... I give him a mechadendrite thumbs up. It works better in the original though. <laughs> it's your shitty human language. Uh, is that it for your turn? Yes. Uh, yep. Halt. Alright, so... Uh, I can't see the other two that had been added. Where are they at? Oh, they're over there. Okay. They're up in the tree. They're not moving. At least, not yet. Yeah, but the last one wasn't moving until I could have shot at it, and then it came over and tried to ruin his life. Yeah, so... My life's already uh, ruined, so... It, <laughs> I'm gonna, it's too I'm late. go after this guy. So I'll go a couple steps over to open up line of sight. Okay. Seems fine. Oh boy, which peril of the warp do I want this time? Uh, good one. So many good to choose from. Yeah, good one. Turn into a, a horrible monstrous demon. That sounds no, fun. No, not that one. Do I want an ethereal storm, a blood ethereal. rain, ethereal Ooh. whatever? That's a good video game. Not really. It's kind of bad, actually. Uh, oh, actually, instead of Ethereal Storm, it's Rending the Veil, which makes everybody have to test against a Fear 3 oh, shock. Let's not do that. Wait, I, what type of fear? Three. It, yeah, it, it, well, it's going to be warp. Yeah, so it wouldn't help. Your thing would not help for this. Damn it. Or I can warp out of existence for a minute. I mean... Where would you go? I would just disappear into the warp. I think no. I, I think it, bad. no. I think he just disappears from time. I think it's temporal incontinence. He just disappears yeah. and then he comes back I, a I, minute I, later and is I, like, "Oh, howdy!" So really, Here's none love. of these are very good. That's we thirty-one. Just, um, just need a gorilla to make you a time belt. Yeah. It's an Overwatch reference. I got it. 
I didn't. Well, I know, but maybe that YouTube didn't. Well, I mean, I'm sure YouTube... I mean, they do always appreciate when we explain the jokes. Yeah. <laughs> Some of them need it. Hello! Boom! Roasted YouTube. You're just oh, gonna take that. More that our jokes were bad. I can't believe I just roasted all of YouTube at once there. Yeah, that's... That's mm. pretty amazing. I mean, someone left a comment and said they were from Brazil, so you're still oh, big in Brazil. Okay. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do... Even after the Olympics. I would've found gold. <laughs> you would've. Yeah. Um, so what I'll, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to select Rending the Veil, but I'm yeah. moving it down by six, so it's actually Dark Summoning instead. Okay, so which I'm just summoning what? a warp. I'm summoning a warp predator. Whatever. Uh, so one... Why would that be? No, okay. we dealt with those. No big deal. No, Maybe like we'll it's better than anything monsters. else because two of them ruin your guys' ability to do anything. One of them sends me out of existence for a minute. So I mean, that's not too bad. Yeah. I how also long take are, how one d10 are... permanent does toughness it, does damage. Does it say what it's supposed to be? That's worse. Yeah, the toughness damage is the, yeah. the permanent damage. It, it's just it's worse. just an actual warp predator, right? Yeah, it's just, just like, a warp predator. It's the shitty demon. We've killed yeah, like it's just, 20 of those. Yeah, we, we've killed dozens, so it's not going to be an issue. Uh, let me see. In Famous the last words. Predators are. I, like it I said, is in chapter 14, tools. Adversaries and Aliens. Yeah, okay. Oh, one of those. Okay, got you. Yeah. Okay. Like somebody that's irrelevant, basically. Yep, where does it uh, show up? It spawns within 3d10 meters of me. So oh, it spawns 20, between. 24 meters away from me. Or up somewhere to 24 within, meters away. Somewhere within 24 meters away. Yeah, anywhere. For, GM's and description. It, it, next to it. Roll, uh, roll a scatter. Uh, it also only exists for one round. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's just because we have a wizard. It's not even, like, part of the description. <laughs> just kill it and extend it. No, I mean, the warp's obviously weird here. Uh, okay, so you want me to roll a scatter? How does that work? Don't even bother. Okay. <laughs> if it's not in range, he's only gonna be here for a turn anyway. It, it appears right there. there you oh, mean, maybe, maybe uh, it appears for longer because we're next to a warp storm. Okay, so I hit uh, Shelled Beast One, this guy, seven times. Okay. Oh, you're not helping. I'm crying. pretty sure he dies. Uh, Listen to it screams of pain. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I almost feel bad. Just turn off your emotion chip. No, I can't do that. It's dead. <laughs> you, 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 you send all these bolts of force flying at it and it just blast it to pieces as chunks of the shell go flying off and impact into the soft center of it and it finally just explodes and there's little pieces of tentacle and shell all fancy all cutting mm. off yeah I, I think it ended with all around it yeah I would imagine or all over perhaps <laughs> All around the mulberry bush. It's it's like uh, uh, misfits. You just you complete the the sentences. <laughs> okay. Uh, next is your crew. Oh, you should so... roll initiative for that warp predator to see if he even gets a turn. All oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> so he can walk up to me, do nothing, and then vanish. It's still spooky. Maybe he's got a charge attack. Yeah. Shake it to the your very core. Actually, he would go right now. <laughs> oh my god. Hey! Perfect. Great. Yeah, he gets Rawr. to go for the crew. So, yep, okay. Um, he uh, hates me, so he's only going to attack me, by the way. Okay, he... He's like, what the hell, dude? He <laughs> runs out. <laughs> I, I was, I was uh, cooking some hot dogs, and now I'm here. <laughs> In snail hell. Makes it charge Cooking some hot dogs with the actual <laughs> hot dogs. And he, no, he misses. <laughs> they're warp hot dogs, All right. so they're wiggly. Classic okay, so you, your crew predator. Uh, uh, your crew here, the one next to IB, is going to be the creature right next to it. Was he using the warp mustard that we got before? Probably. 
jerk. You know what they're like. Now he's covered in snail. Gross. And he kills it. He point blank shoots it straight through the top of the shell and causes it to blow up. Do we get splattered with guts? Oh, you totally do. Yeah, there's <sighs> all this guts. There's guts everywhere. It's right here. Yep. Constantly. Uh, your next crew here uh, is attacking these one that is. Ah, but he misses. Uh, Karek gets to attack that one as well. Do you think Nogan's like muting? Is it, is he, are you muting yourself? No. No, I think he's just cutting off. Yeah, I think sometimes he's cutting himself off where he just stops talking suddenly. And sometimes and, uh, it's just Discord being funky. Kenor, it's your turn. Uh, the, the two of the crew missed when attacking this. Okay. Show, uh, the 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 ones up here are they doing they have anything? Not, no, they are just hanging from the tree. They are like hanging up with their shells upside down and with their tentacles just wrapped around a branch. So okay. they're slothing it up right now. Pretty yeah, much. So, yes. And and the one that came down, we attacked that thing first, right? Yep. Uh, I be attacked it. Yes. Yeah. So I'm just gonna. Well, okay. I'm just gonna use my wrath, uh, wrath plasma pistols then. I can't believe that it's a completely total and natural reaction for all creatures across the universe to hate Icarus. <laughs> but to be fair, Icarus attacked this thing <laughs> in cold blood. This disorder was like, you're having too much fun there, buddy. And Cooked it. Then I'm using my other plasma pistol and do, uh, doing the same thing. Because that's how I roll. Can you see past? Oh yeah, you can. You can get. It's huge, so you can see up to here. That's fine. Okay, go ahead. And you kill it. Hooray! Okay. Uh, the other ones up here aren't doing anything. Uh, do you, do you want your crew to attack them or? No, uh, it's their turn right now. If you can say something, them if well. Don't, don't, I'm, I'm gonna say don't shoot the docile ones. Okay. Then, unless, uh, they, they stand down, uh, Merrick or Icarus are going to think that it's the end of combat. Hmm. Well, you can, you can, you can kill the warp beast. Yeah. Let's shoot that thing. Go ahead. You don't know it's gonna disappear any time soon. Yep. Exactly. Do we know that? No, of course. Yeah, you guys have no idea. You just uh, showed up. It could be forever. You want your crew to attack it, I guess? They can. Yeah, make, why not? It would make sense that they would, because they yeah. don't know. Because nobody right, knows it's going to disappear this one, in a This second. one moves up here. and Also, second. it's it's like the one thing I'm actually scared of, so I'd probably tell them to shoot it. Shoot that thing! Shoot it! Shoot it! Alright, uh. So, are the crew going before yeah. I go? Uh, he missed. This one takes a step here and starts shooting at that. Uh, Abbott and Geist. And they both miss. So now it's Merrick's turn. Hooray! Uh, distance... Why does it say distance zero? It's clearly not zero away from me. Yeah, distance is my stuff right now. I don't know why. I have to click on myself again. It's, it's five away about. from you. It's, yeah. it's the wall. I was just making sure that was short for this gun. and not. It is, it is short, yeah. Well, it depends on the, the gun. Right. Uh, attack, I just got that. Am I trained? Yes. Wish you could remember that. Wow, that was garbage. You miss. Hmm? Oh, you hit, but it... Yeah, uh, I do hit. It's just not a great hit. Oh, you didn't, you didn't uh, click him to do the damage, I see. Okay, so damage... I did. This stupid game. And it has to do the toxic thing. Uh, no, it's immune to that. Oh, Stupid war beasts. Uh, Icarus. Am I actually going to be able to see it from anywhere? Uh, yeah, you can see it from yeah, where from you're like a little bush. Oh, so I can just shoot it. Alright, I'll do that then. Yeah, this bush thing here is it? it's actually a, a tree. You know, a trunk, like, right here, but all these other leaves and stuff are way up above you. Mm -hmm. You could always just... Like, what size is it? 
I think they're normal size, average size. Uh, yeah, it's yeah, it's normal. it's average size. And is it in melee? Nope. Yes. Oh yes, it is. Oh, I didn't take care of it, so I would have missed then. That's okay. Uh, and it's short range. Short. Yep. I think. Yeah. So, sudden attack, half short range. I've forgotten what size he said. Average. Normal. Average. Average. In melee. Attack. Hmm. I hit the tree. Well done. Well, we all got to hit something. Marcella? She's not going to do anything. Actually, okay, if I hit the other... tree, would the tree try and kill me? Uh, it de- you 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 do hit the tree, and it kind of shakes and shudders and sways around, but it doesn't uh, it doesn't Screams attack you or anything. It, this one doesn't scream; it doesn't make any noise. Uh, Anadar. Um, I mean, I guess I'll walk over and shoot this stupid thing. I guess I'll kill the horrible. I guess I'll kill. The- I am the- I am the scourge of chaos after all. That's what they call you. That's what they call me. Yeah. Point blank for ears in melee, right? Yep. Average. <sighs> I can't believe you have to kill that thing. Someone's got to do it. It's 11. Right, yeah, it is. Five El- hits. Go ahead. Eleven. And it pops out of existence. Not a living anymore. Nope. Well, who knows? Scourge of Chaos strikes again. Well. Okay. That was fun. Can we ever land on a planet that's not trying to kill us, Captain? Um. Let me think about it. Uh. Sigmund's Folly usually doesn't. Football. Well, do you I mean, the, remember all the ghosts? Sigmund Folly tried to kill us the first time. Yeah, he did, um, he did the first time. Yeah. Footfall yeah, is not fixed it. Footfall is in a planet. No, Cobalt? Cobalt hasn't tried to kill us. Uh, neither is Demaris. Yeah, Demaris is probably the best planet. Well, I mean, Demaris tried, you, you know. What? They he tried didn't do to. Anything. Well, not the planet itself, but it's there were the people Inquisitor. on it. Yeah, exactly. That wasn't very nice. So the planet's fine. Well, yeah, if we're just going on planets, yeah. Sure. Um, let's just see if the things in the trees do anything for a bit. Uh, Grunty has lost power. Disconnected. Oh. All right. Too strong. He says, he says he'll come back when he can. <laughs> okay. Wow, he's the... Okay. I thought you meant in game. He'd just been drained. Yeah, he's like, <laughs> like, like, oh. no, 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 no. no. Like he, he's actually oh. disconnected from the game because all of all of Merrick's just, juice just it, leaks out of him. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he happens and Merrick slumps over. I guess that's a perfect time uh, for us to say goodbye to YouTube then. Bye, Bye YouTube. YouTube. Bye, YouTube.